Hello. Okay, you guys. So I was thinking, I was sitting around, not sitting around. I don't sit around. <laughs> yes, I do. I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't matter. So I was sitting here and I was thinking to myself, how can I help everyone see that this is actually something that they can do if they're super busy or if someone has just started and they don't know what to do or where to go, what can I do to break it down for them? And here's what I came up with, you guys. Um, I think that this is something that will really, really help so many people. Um, if you're new, if you're not new, but you just don't know where to start, um, I think that this will help you. So if you don't have a planner, first of all, please, please, please go get one. Like Walmart has them. CVS has them. Um, they're like $5. You can go get like a cheap one or you can do like I did and spend, you know, $25 on a really nice Erin Condren planner. I am obsessed with planners. You guys, they will be your best friend in this business. Okay. Um, so my very first thing that I wanted to say was go get yourself a planner because with Without a planner, I don't know, maybe I'm the only one, but here's the thing, you guys, writing your goals down and breaking down your week is so much easier and it will help you to stay accountable and to get the things done that you really need to get done, okay? So what I recommend for everyone in this business, whether you have a goal of green or whether you have a goal of yellow or whether you just want to make $100 extra per month, okay? It doesn't matter what your goal is. This is how I think the best thing or the best way that you could go about it is I would recommend setting very small goals. Okay. So go to your sponsor and say, Hey, here's my goal. I want to be yellow by this date. Or my goal is I want to sell $500 this month. Go to your sponsor and let them know what is your goal so that they can break this down and set expectations with you. Now, if you don't speak to your sponsor, that's okay. Um, come to someone else. Come to me. That's okay. Um, Really try to build that relationship with your sponsor, though, you guys. That is so big, so huge. Reach out to someone else who's not even your sponsor and brainstorm with them. Build relationships with the girls on your team, even if they're not directly on your downline or directly on your upline. It doesn't matter where they are. If you are a presenter with Unique, we are all on the same team, okay? We're all on the same team here, okay? We're all here to help everyone. We're all here to help everybody succeed and make a difference, okay? So reach out to someone and let them know, hey, this is my goal. What do you think, okay? What should I do to, um, to get to where I want to be? So then your planner is going to come in, okay? And hang on one second. Come here, Kai. Okay, so your planner, this is where your planner is going to come into play. Okay, so say you have a goal of $500 a month. Or no, say you have a goal of $1,000 a month. You want to sell $1,000 this month. Okay, so break that down into four weeks. Okay, break that down into four weeks. And what I want you to do is say, how much do I need each week to sell $1,000 a month? Okay, so this is where you're going to use your, your planner. So at the beginning of each week, I want you to write that weekly goal that you need, okay? And I want you to set little weekly goals. On top of your weekly goals, I want you to set daily goals too. Okay, so what I'm going to say is if you, so what's, what is that? It's 25, it's 20, 250 each week, right? Which is so easy. So easy to do that. So here's what you're going to do, okay? So to sell 250 a week, what I would recommend is having at least two parties going per week, okay? If you can do three, oh my gosh, you will definitely get to your goal. Definitely, okay? So I would say put on, put down on Wednesday, party starting. And write down two to three names. If you can't get two, that's okay. Just put down one. Whatever you can do is great, okay? And then maybe on Tuesday and Thursday – you're going to make a product video. So write down which products you're going to use in those videos. Okay, so maybe do that like twice a week. But it all depends. Like I said, you guys, it depends on how much time you have. So setting those small goals for yourself and writing them down so that you know what you have to do that day. There's a girl on my team, Sonia. What she does every single morning is she wakes up and she does a video of herself doing her makeup. She's going to do her makeup anyways. Might as well just make a video about it, right? 
This girl sells over $2,000 every single month, you guys, just because she does a video of herself putting her makeup on. So setting a small goal every single week, every single goal will make that attainable. So say you have to sell $250 in that week. How many mascaras is that? How many liquid foundations is that? How many collections is that? How many of something that you truly love is that, that you truly believe that you can sell a ton of? Break it down. I call that mascara math. Okay, so break it down into mascara math. Um, so, you know, message, you know, make it, put put down on one of your days, like uh, send follow-up messages on, to, on Monday. Um, on, you know, just it depends on what you can do, but set those small goals, you guys. And, 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 and having a big goal is the most important thing because then you can break that big goal down into small goals, okay? But here's the thing. Do not ever compare yourself to anyone else. Do not ever, 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 ever get down on yourself because you don't make your goal. The reason why you set goals is so that you can attempt to achieve them. If you don't achieve it one month, move on to the next month and try to achieve it again. Okay? You can do this. You can do this. If you break down your weeks and you say, okay, so this day I'm going to do an eye look and, you know, focus on like a few products every single, you know, every month. Choose like five products that you're going to talk about every single month. Okay? Because if those, it takes people five times to see something before they're like, okay, I need that. Okay, so if you're making videos and you're posting pictures, you know, every single day, it will happen because people are going to be seeing your stuff. Okay, so what I do is I don't ever shut up about the BB cream mixed with the concealer. And guess what I sell like crazy? That. Okay, I talk about palettes a lot. So I sell a lot of palettes, you guys. I talk about lip products a lot. So I sell a lot of lip products. Think about what you truly love because that is exactly what you will sell the most of, okay? Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. This is a simple business. Is it hard to do? Yes. But the concept is very, very simple, okay? So you book, you sell, you sponsor, Okay, so break it down on your calendar. Your goal is $1,000 a month. That's $250 a week. What do you have to do to sell $250 a week? You have to talk to a few people. You have to post attraction marketing. So on each day, break it down. Break it down and write down what you are capable of in that day. What do you have time for in that day? Are you scared to make videos? Get over it, okay? You have to get over it because your videos are probably incredible. I used to be terrified to make videos. You guys, terrified. I wouldn't even speak in them. I would not speak in my videos at all. At all. I would literally never even let anyone hear my voice in the videos, ever. It took me a month, a whole month to get over that. And then I started talking in them, but not very much. Then... People started really giving me a lot of love on my videos and I started to gain more confidence because the more that I did them, the easier they got, okay? So my, what I want for you guys to do is to write down your fears. Write down what fears you have, okay? And I want you to stare at those fears and I want you to tell those fears that they don't have a bearing on your success. They will not hold you back and you will get over this. You will get over your fears and you will conquer them and you will be successful. It doesn't matter how many times you fall flat on your face, you will conquer those fears and you will get to that goal that you are setting for yourself. Have a big goal, break it down into small goals and ask me or ask someone else, or figure it out how you can achieve those goals. Booking parties will get you your PRS. Posting videos will get you your PRS. Think of income producing activities, posting pictures, posting videos, booking parties, sending messages, talking to people, building relationships, you guys. Sending messages and just complimenting people to build up your algorithm. Go through and, and, and take 15 minutes a day and comment on people's posts as you see them come through your newsfeed. But write that stuff down on your calendar so you're not all over the place and you're not freaking out. You know what I mean? So break it down and write down the stuff that you need to do, okay, every single week. Because some of you I know are very, very busy. So figure out what's important 
and do those things and do them wisely, okay? And you will be successful. Break your big goal down into small goals and give yourself some tasks every single day and you will make it happen. You you, you definitely will. You definitely will, okay? Um, that's it, you guys. That's really it. Take a big goal, break it down, okay? Face your fears. Do not let them decide your fate. They are just fears. It's just a word, a four-letter word, fear. Doesn't that sound silly that you let something that is four letters long hinder your success? Smash that four-letter word and get with it. Go for it. Make it happen. You deserve the success. Get out there and go for it, you guys. Go for it, okay? I would love to brainstorm some tasks with you. I would love to help you guys achieve your goals and get there. So let's do it together, okay? Let's do this together. Shout out your goals. Tell us what you're going to do and let us hold you accountable. Let us cheer you on, okay? You can do this. You can do this, okay? So get out there. Take your big goal. Make it a small goal and do daily tasks and you'll be well on your way. Bye, guys.